All right. So we, um, my session we do see this evening is uh, is a Q and A session as well. Um, yeah. So it's it's a Q and A session as well, and I just want to ask him a couple of questions, and and then once we're done with with him, we'll bring this to a close. Okay. Good. Fantastic. So let's 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 get into it now. So I was I was saying that the first time I actually. I, you know, I really don't know whether we did we meet uh, before the Green Worship Project. Had we me, ever met before that? No. No, uh, no. of course. I'm trying no. to see if my yeah. So I mean, it was it was of course we had been chatting. We have been talking a, maybe a year or two before before that. Now, let me let me say something to you, right? Um, there, there's there's a ring of uniqueness, you know about about your songs you know um because a lot of people when they, when people do music you're thinking of okay i want my music to be played on radio um, mm. you obviously don't give that kind of position because your music is 10 minutes long 11 minutes 12 minutes <laughs> so unless the djs go to say ah uh, we're playing part one and then you guys can come <laughs> so, so obviously you know um uh, you know, so I'm looking at the length of your songs. I'm looking at the wordings of your song. I mean, the other day I was, yes, if I just watching um, uh, Open Up, uh, the one as you did it again on, on the Green Worship Project, you know, I started yes. to think about the words. It was like you were, you know, just, you know, preaching. You know, I, I, I must say that there must, maybe, I don't know whether there's a pressure, maybe you felt a pressure, you know, because there's this pressure to just do things the way people do. I mean, the way music just sounds, you know, just blend in. Yes, but you, mm. I mean, but what is coming from you, you know, it's just, it's just different. I, I wanted to just, you know, speak to that, you know, um, to that process mm. uh, of songwriting, that uniqueness, you know, I, I wanted to just, you know, talk about that. Okay, well, um, thank you, sir. Thank you for the opportunity. Thank you for all, the, uh, thank you all the speakers that have spoken. Mm -hmm. Pastor Nath, Thank you so much, um, Minister Gozi. Did I get it right? Yeah, Gozi. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Thank thank you so much. And every other person. Well, I think um for me, song uh, I really I, I I tell people and I say this carefully. My own coming from my background or my discipline in school, I'm an industrial chemist by training. Okay. So I'm a pure science student. And um, uh, as, as most of you know, my journey, uh, I've been the bass player and then the music director. And I've never, uh, never for once wanted to either sing mm. or write music. Mm. So I, 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 think, I think with the way the Lord has worked with me over the years, I, I can say that I don't write. I just hear mm. and then put it down. Yes, I know that there's a part of as a part of um, uh, experience and skill over the year. And let me, let me, let me, let, I always tell people, God made the animals, but told Adam to name them. Mm. Yeah. So there's something, there's something residue in me that God had put in me that makes me interpret the songs or know the right words to say over the years by experience. And then, you know, so that's for me. So when, when I, I, I don't have a writing session. Mm. Uh, it's all by the spirit of God. I just wait. I just wait in His presence, and not not for a song. I always tell people, mm. uh, don't go to God for a song. Desire a relationship, and it will give you a well. Mm. That that is how God has helped me. I I just I just kind of just want to enjoy His presence. Mm. Uh, you know, what I mean, just want to stay alone, be with Him praying, not, not asking for anything, mm. just to enjoy him and mm. let him enjoy me. Mm. So in this place of encounter, the words literally just jump at me. Mm. Sometimes in pictures, sometimes I just, I just out unconsciously start saying words. And when I realize, when I gain conscious, I'm like, what are you saying? Mm. So, so that, that is, that, that, that's my journey. That's my journey. In as much as I believe in songwriting, I believe that God has just helped me to, and of course, it starts inspiring me. Like, okay, let, let's use Open Up as, as an example. Right. Um, I was praying and I saw 
two blocked fallopian tubes. Mm. Mm. That was where the that's where the journey of open up started from. And I started saying in the midst of prayer, no, I didn't I've never thought about it, I've never heard it from anybody, I've never seen it anywhere. Channels of my spirit open up. Mm. So I was praying, it was a it was a prayer for me. And then mm. as soon as I started saying that, the 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 uh, the remaining of the world start, started jumping back at me. I am with mm. the father, open up. Mm. No boundaries, no limit, based on the fact that I saw two blocked fallopian mm. tubes. Mm. You know, that, that talks about your reproductive system. Right. And it could be spiritual, it could be physical. So, you know, so no boundaries, no limits. So I let deep call on to deep open. That, way, that was where it came from. Mm. And then later the next day or that evening, I can't remember right now. Mm. I think the next day, the Lord started giving me out of the mundane to where I'm ordained. I just mm. feel that this is just inspired by the Spirit. Of course, mm. the Spirit, people must know that the Holy Spirit is limited, is, is as limited, it, it will be limited in your life mm. based on your level of, 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 um, of knowledge and understanding. It won't be mm. able to give you more. Absolutely. Like, like if I've not heard, if I have never heard the word mundane, I wouldn't have wrote, wrote uh, it down. Mm, yeah. So yeah. true. So, so true. So the Holy Spirit will be limited, mm. is limited to the container. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. So, so that was, that was how it worked for me. That was mm. how it worked for me. So, and that's how all my writing sessions have always been. I just feel that these are messages that the Lord has given me part time. Mm. And then, you know, it keeps coming to me. So, mm. That, that, that's my and, and you know let, let me balance it this way First John 5 verse 8 mm. says there are three things that bear witness on the earth mm. the water the blood and the spirit mm. what does that mean that means that whatever the spirit of the Lord is telling you must be confirmed in the word mm. and the blood must agree so you mm. cannot just come up with fantasies in your mind I say I have I am I'm inspired to write a lyric. No, and I'm talking I'm talking I'm talking now based on the, my experience. Everything the Lord has given me as a song, He has confirmed it in His Word. Mm. So when when the Lord gives me songs like that, I go back to the Word and make sure that the Word is agreeing with what I'm singing. Right. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Amazing. Let me ask you a question. There's one, there's one particular song that I love. Um, if all I say is Jesus, Jesus, Jesus <laughs> that's more than enough. I mean, tell me, what's the story behind that song? I... <laughs> okay. Um, so I, I always do this thing. Uh, I always stay still in the presence of the Lord. Mm. And I, keep, I, I will always blank out. Uh, so what I do is, over time, when I'm still in the presence of God, I, I start editing every thought in my mind till I can mm. streamline to only God. Mm. Mm. Yeah. So I remember this day that I was in the presence and many things were distracting me at the same time. Many things were distracting me at the same time. So I said to the Lord, today I don't know what's happening. <laughs> And I was going to church, but even I say to you today is Jesus, mm. Jesus, Jesus. That's more than enough. And mm. as soon as I said, as soon as I said that, mm. it was as if they just shut out every other thought mm. in my in my mind. Mm. You know, I've been struggling for more than two hours on the spot, mm. more than two hours on the spot, trying to see what's happening. I, I just wanted to worship and just bless him. But right. different thoughts around me were, were just distracting me. And I'm like, what's happening to the Lord? Mm. Okay, if all I say to you today is Jesus, that's more than it. And as soon as I said Jesus, it was as if they shot all that thoughts in my mind. Mm. Mm. So that was where the word, the, the verse came from. You have captured my heart. Right. Consumed. Yeah, because at that point, it, it was as if they just captured everything. Mm. Mm. So that, that was that that's the experience. That's what brought that song. And then as I began to as I began to live the song, you know, let me say this to people listening. 
always try to leave your songs before you release them. Never be in a hurry. Mm. Mm. I remember Kotka telling us, uh, like, uh, uh, when he came around and uh, I, we hosted him at that time, and I was asking him, what's the story behind the, um, I almost let go. Mm. And I, after he told us the story, I'm like, okay, so um, what advice do you have for us? And he said to us, he said, we released, I almost let go four years after. Mm. We have been singing it in our church. That's it. So mm. they leave the song mm. before the song was released. Mm. Mm. So there's not, you don't have to be in a audio, oh, God is, no, leave the song as much mm. as is possible. Mm. As much as, you know, I said there's an unjust in the spirit mm. for you to release. Yeah. Leave the song. So yeah. so that's the story about the fall I say is Jesus, basically. Yeah. Amazing. I mean, it's amazing that you, 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 you say that. One of the things I always tell people about uh, the songs that we write and people be in a hurry, I say, look, the songs we write is good news. It's not CNN. It's not about mm. uh, uh, President Buhari <laughs> or Donald Trump. It's good news. Yes, sir. Right? And, you know, it's not going out of fashion. So, <laughs> mm. <laughs> you know, if it comes out tomorrow or the day mm. after tomorrow, you know, yes, it's still... I mean, it's still. Thank you so much for 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 sharing, for sharing that. Let me. So let me ask. Let me ask this question. Um, yes, sir. You you've 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 come. Don't let me say you've come. Everybody has come a long way, you know. Uh, mm. <laughs> uh, but so when you look back, what are the lessons you've uh, you've learned? You know that now. No, no, no. Don't let me don't let me ask that because there's something in, in my mind that I wanted to ask. Now, this is before you came on, I I was going to share an example of someone like uh, Shola Listen uh, when she writes. Uh, one of the things that intrigues me with Shola and also your songwriting and I mean everybody else, Nathaniel and Cole, is and, and you mentioned it. You mentioned it just now that look, for instance, if you didn't know what the word, if you never had the word mundane, you would not, I mean, you would not have been there. And so when I look yes, at someone sir. like Shola Listen, for instance, I look at, you know, the, the, the so she understands that Yoruba language. And then, yes. you know, she's able to deploy it, you know, oh. deploy it <laughs> in whatever way she feels in her, in her, in her heart. So, and so you, you find out that there is a place for understanding, there's a place for knowledge, and then yes, there's a place for the spirit. So I wanted to just talk, talk to that. You know, how do you balance, you know, the, the flow of the spirit and, you know, understanding, you know, knowledge, you know, yes, using the right words at the right time to explain and describe exactly what you see in your spirit. Okay, sir. Hmm. Okay, so like I said, I'm going to say that again. The Holy Spirit is limited to your scope. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's limited. It's, it's limited to the container. So um, what I do is, uh, okay, so I'm, and I'm going to talk, uh, I'm going to go music a bit. Mm. So like uh, when the Lord gives me a song, you know, being a musician for years, um, uh, uh, being a bass player, being a music director, all these are factors that are playing. And then, you know, that's your journey. Mm. I, I always tell people, you don't be in a hurry. Mm. God who knows where you are going, mm. knows where you, you are supposed to walk through and then, you know. So it, it, my, my experience as music director, scoring songs, mm -hmm. getting, you know, writing the lyrics of songs down yeah. and then playing with different songs over the years. Right. Added to the, if I, I believe that God waited till I had that level of knowledge mm. before He could release me, mm. Mm. before He could release these songs to me, and I believe mm. that He's waiting for me to grow again before He mm. can release some level. Mm. Mm. So I, so it, it plays out because you will be able to like, I, I, I get to the others with songs, and my, my members are saying, my team members are saying. Oh, so I think the way you said it, we could say it this way. Mm. And I'm flexible. Once it doesn't change the message and mm. the intent of the line, oh, why not? We can mm. change it. 
if it's just going to like okay so we recorded a song yesterday and it wasn't so fluent saying some words together mm. so what we had to do was to rearrange what comes first mm. so this the holy spirit will not take the place of knowledge you have mm. to get it yeah you have to get it and you know you have to you know like um Paul said in First Corinthians to First Corinthians two, he was talking to he was talking to people and he said, "Jesus is both the wisdom and the power of God." Mm. Said to the Jews, power to mm. the Greek, wisdom. Mm. So it depends. You can take both, but mm. you know, but you know, some people they prefer to okay, they just want to be you know you. And I, I believe I'm talking to Christians here. Yeah. You can't you can't say you just want to be you just want to know about something. I thank God. I'm, I'm sure Pastor Matt we have will have touched it. We'll have touched this part. You can't just say you just want to be a songwriter. Uh, you know, I'm good with. There are many people good with words, but the letter kills. You must understand that mm. only the spirit gives life. Yeah. So in in acquiring wisdom, you must understand the place mm. of God. Yeah. And so I believe that. In in blending both together, it, it it will really help you in conveying the message of the song adequately. Mm. Mm. I hope I've answered this question. Yeah, you have, you have, you have, you have. Now let me. I I mean I I said I was going to ask this. You know, um, mm. you know, one of the you 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 live in Nigeria. One of the denials that people I think one of the issues. Okay, let, let me let, let me let me put it this way. Um, during the the course of this pandemic, you know, I I ran something called the daily worship infusion, and every day I was I would put together worship songs, you know, just to help people. I created a playlist on on um, on YouTube, and one of the challenges that I had during this period was getting songs. You know, because a lot of the songs that we used to sing. Uh, maybe pre-COVID, you know, this you know, God buttered my bread. He did this for me. We couldn't sing them during COVID. You understand? Mm. They would just somebody <laughs> would just slap your face. That oh, well, that's not what we're talking about now. Can we just? <laughs> I just, I just, I just, I just want to love God. So, um, yeah. you know, you last year you 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 lost your wife. Um, oh. you know, I I wanted to ask, you know. What, how has that affected your, you know, your song, your songwriting? You know, because we have, a, we have a whole, sometimes you even go to a church that to even sing a song that talks about, you know, um, how did I put it? I mean, for instance, I wrote Today When Troubles Come My Way and I had a lot of pastors yes. say, ah, I'm not going to sing that song. I mean, uh, they change the words. You know, so, comes, like, <laughs> comes, you know, so I, I wanted to find out, you know, how, how has that, you know, affected your 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 view, you know, with respect to, you know, to, to songwriting and ministry. Okay. General, so, yeah, yeah. Okay, so um, when my wife passed, um, but the first thing I do, God had trained me over the years that when things happen in spite of how painful it may be or how 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 close or how you know how so concerned or how so um, uh, what how close in proximity you are to the issue mm. the first thing you must do is to look from where god is look 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 at the situation from from god's standpoint right mm. so the only place i could run to and the only person I could run to, thank God for comfort, thank God for people around. Mm. But one of the things I remember, if you couldn't find me in that season without, a, without my acoustic guitar, mm. it was always with me. Mm. It was always with me, even to the burial ground. Mm. I couldn't survive without worship. Mm. So that made me more vulnerable in his presence. Mm. I remember months and days after, weeks after, the only place I could cry was in his presence. Mm. 
Mm. I will weep like a baby. Mm. I will weep till till I have a dick. I mean, serious a dick. I will mm. weep. Mm. I will weep and weep and weep. And this was, though my, my tears was not verbalized in words, but I knew he knew what I was saying. Like, mm. Let me say it in Yoruba. Say me both if fair. Do me, do to me what you want. Mm. I, you know, it was it was just a place in my life that um, running away from God was never an option. I remember mm. talking to uh, Bishop Abi. He called me on the phone one day like that. I knew God sent it to me, and mm. he said it clearly. He said, "David, don't lose your song, or else you will drown." Mm. I will never forget. I will never forget that. Or I will never forget that conversation. Mm. And he dropped the phone, and that mm. was it. Mm. So you know, so that season pulled me closer to who could help me. Mm. I knew that I couldn't get comfort from anybody. Mm. The only person I could run to was God. So mm. that season broke me more. Mm. I became more vulnerable. Of course, I am still vulnerable. You know, you know, and then I started finding answers in his presence. Mm. Now, yes, it doesn't take away the pain. It doesn't take away the pain that I feel, the, you know, the pain of the loss, mm. like, you know, the loss of, you know, but it, being in his presence and, and, and I'm, I'm just being open because I want people to learn. Mm. I remember a birthday this year. It was a Sunday. I came back just in August. I came back from church and I just wanted to lie down, lie before his presence and just watch it because I, I know what that can do. I, 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 you know, I'm in a vulnerable state. So, you know, days like that, you are vulnerable. So you just want to. So, and then the only place I could run to was not to go and meet my friends or just to come and lay in his presence, even if I cannot talk, let me just say that. And then the Lord opened my eyes and I saw the saint in heaven. Mm. And I saw how captivated they were to the glory of God and how distracted they were. And the Lord said to me, these people don't even send you guys on earth. <laughs> <laughs> they are so distracted Mm. I'm using the word distraction, distracted in, in, intentionally. Mm. They're so distracted with my glory, they don't even send you. As mm. a matter of fact, they are pitying you guys here. Mm. That moment changed my life forever. Mm. It helped me compartmentalize my pain. Mm. You know, I, I'm talking about this year. So I, I knew when, you know, when I went to Christ, I was like, <laughs> People don't really send us. Right? They, are, they are even they are better than us. Now mm. the pain, of course, you feel the vo you know. But I I I I like I'll be here worshiping all of all of my yeah all of yeah. the days of my life well, came uh, from that experience. Mm, mm. I'll be here lifting and even when it isn't easy yeah. came from that experience. Mm. So these are just my conversations in the yeah. so like I'll be here. There's yeah. nowhere I want to run to. Yeah. There's no place I want to go to. Then yeah. This is where I will stay. Yes. This is where you will always find me. Yes. And you know, so th that effect is shifted. Like there's a song, I I've not released it, but the word says, staying away, back in the noise. Shutting, mm. okay, staying away, back in the storm, shutting the mm. noise. Your presence mm. is the difference. Mm. You know, where do you run to? Mm. When things happen. So mm. I, I think that season of my life, really made me more vulnerable in this you know it broke me down mm. made me of course i'm still a work in in progress mm. you know it made me so vulnerable in his presence the only place i just want to be the only person mm. i want to cry in front is mm. in front of his god so mm. you know it, it was it, it was a, it, it's a turning point in my life of course pain, the, the pain birth purpose and, yes but you know yeah so so that that's all i can say about that Man, I, I'm so, right now, I mean, I'm, I'm so, I'm so emotional. Um, but, um, you know, what you said is, is so true. That's just reality. Those guys over there, 
They're no senders. No, they are. No. They are consumed. You know, and 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 that should actually affect the kind of songs that we that we write. You know, yes, worship sir. worship on earth as it is in heaven. Worship on yes, earth sir. as it is in heaven. You know. Um, yes. I just want to say thank you uh, to you. Now I, I want to do that. two things uh, before we close. I. I think Nathaniel is still on. I like if we if you can still hear me. I want I like you to just lead us in prayers and do see you also you know just just pray over Nath. If you're still there, I can I see I see you're still here. Yeah. Uh, even okay. if it's just okay, please just pray. Okay. Pray for pray for pray for us and then I ask to see to also pray afterwards. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Father, in Jesus' name. Amen. We we are full of thanks and not just full of flowing for this time. This time of just fellowshipping and because it's been all about you. It's it's not about the songwriting. It's yes. just more about you. Yes. We've, we've we've sat down here conversing on just how to better represent you to our generation and also better express ourselves to you. So Father, we give you all the glory. For every gift and giftings here, we say thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. For you've really just blessed and furnished your church with such mm -hmm. tremendous giftings, tremendous gifts. Just sitting oh. down here and listening to the wells flowing from them is is, is a blessing. So, Father, we give you thanks in Jesus' name. Thank you. And, Amen. Father, for everyone who has attended, everyone represented, thank you for what you are doing, for the seeds you have sown tonight okay. that will bear fruit in days, weeks, months, and years to come. Thank you, thank you because this, this would go much beyond our wildest dreams and imagination. Thank you for the next move of God. Thank you for those that will just go back to your presence, those that will return to the place of intimacy. Thank you for those that will seek for knowledge, those who would increase their capacity yes. to know oh. that they can't be limited by their capacity. Thank you oh. for 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 motives that will be aligned for hearts yes. that will be inclined yeah. to yours yes. thank you for fresh oil thank you even for pastor wally and did for for yes. the leadership that he brings to oh. this aspect of the body of christ we give you all the glory in jesus name <laughs> father we ask oh god that you breathe you breathe upon everything that's done here oh. let it oh. cause it to bear fruit 30, 60, and 100 folds Amen. in Jesus' name. Thank you Amen. for those Amen. that you are raising already. Thank you for impartations here already. Thank you because people will say years ago over the internet at the webinar, the anointing of God came upon me. Yes. Such and such are what I have done yes. in Jesus' mighty name. We Amen. pray. Amen. 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 Lucy, just pray for us, please. Thank you, Father. We give you praise. Thank you for this platform. Thank you for this platform you have raised to, to, to bring kingdom, kingdom music into being and then revive the altar of David, tabernacle of David. Thank you, Lord, for the initiative you have given to Pastor Wali Adenoga uh, to 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 lead this generation into the next level. Thank you for every speaker that has spoken today. Thank you for your words that you have put in, in our mouth. Thank you for everyone who is listening. Thank you, Lord, because they are not baskets. They will retain wisdom. Amen. Thank you, Father, Amen. because th this word we we bear much more fruit that will speak in generations to come. And the kingdom of God Amen. shall be established on the earth. Amen. Lord, my prayer for everyone here is that, Lord, according to Psalm 65, verse 4, blessed is the man whom the Lord causes to approach him. That you will cause everyone here to approach you in the name of the Lord Jesus. Not Amen. just for things, but they will Amen. seek your faith. For this is Amen. 
This is Jacob, the generation of those who seek you, who seek your faith. Amen. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Father, I pray that from tonight, there shall be a shift, a shift in levels. A Amen. shift in levels. You will, you, will, you will open people's eyes, people's mind, people's Amen. heart in the name of the Lord Jesus. And Amen. they will begin to bring out sounds from heaven Amen. in the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. We'll give you praise because thoughts are realigned, minds are realigned, Amen. priorities are realigned in the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Father. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, and thank you, Lord, because you are involving us in what you are doing in this season. And the Amen. people who are part of this will Amen. give you praise. Amen. In Jesus' precious Amen. name. Amen.